much. I appreciate you all for this wonderful uh, interview that you are doing. God bless you. Once again, you're welcome, my DG, Lion Doctor Ademola Adisuye, PMGF, NLCF. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. My district governor, sir, I want to welcome you once again and I thank you very much for coming on our Lions set. So having passed through this route and encountered the challenges as highlighted, which I'm very sure you were helped, you were able to overcome by the help of God. What advice do you have for your successor, Lion Kayode Mashinoga, MDM NLC, District Government? Thank you very much. Um my wonderful lion uh, we have done a lot that uh, the lions of the district and outsider have been applauding us like i said at the beginning of this interview uh apart from the membership drive that we were able to bring in not less than 900 and 92 members uh, though there are a lot of members that dropped uh, we're about 400 plus dropped and um, we also had a lot of uh, trainings training program for our lions because we know that um, uh, a trained lion is a better lion and um, Apart from all this that we have done, we have set our district at a pace that is very difficult for other districts to meet up. Presently, we are ahead in so many areas. And um, my advice for my incoming district governor, the district governor elect, Lion Isiak Kayode Oshinoga is that uh, the pace that we have set together. As my first five district governor, we have been on the journey together. And my second five district governor who is coming in as uh, first five district governor too, Lion Arelekon uh, Owolabi, is also uh, aware that um, all the job, all these uh, great things that we have done together, we did them together, and uh, this is the time that they will need to consolidate it. I am very, very sure because I know I have a very good successor in Lion Coyote or Shinoga. Uh, what I would just want him to do is for him to consolidate on what we have done to make sure that all the new clubs we have chartered have been cared for and all the projects that we have uh, done are being maintained because um, we have set a lot of program that so many years in the past that we have not been look looking into like um, the area of boat crews we believe that um, uh, all work no play make jack a, a door boy we have organized boat crews for our lions to enjoy themselves and i am happy to see my incoming district governor doing same he has um he has marked some resources and pick october one as the day of this boat cruise and um, the other one is this uh, beauty uh, that, uh, sorry, the uh, what do I call it? Um, Miss Humanity, Miss Humanity. We said, we said it's beauty contest, we said it's um, a way of getting people to know more about Lion, and uh, this is being organized for our youth, especially our Leos and uh, other people that are youth below 30 years. We said this to involve in this to be able to have one or two things gained from life. That's another program that I will advise that the incoming years look into. And thirdly is the 
um, spelling bee contest, which we did and was so fantastic. Uh, I want him to also look at that too as a program that is laudable. And um, I will want him to also do more of trainings for our lion members, for our clubs, and uh, make sure that uh, more of this training gets directly to the club as we started in this lion year. More importantly, I will want him to also, as well as uh, consider one thing that I have. I have one thing that is very important to me. Whenever I have challenge with members, I take it as part of the position that I am, um, I am uh, uh, holding because um, in this position of leadership. We have a lot of challenges. We have a lot of uh, issues that lie on.